So you've just gotten your Amazon Echo Show and you're ready to get it all set up. I'm gonna show you how to do that in this video, but before we even jump in, I want you to know that you need two things. You're gonna need your Wi-Fi information, which is gonna be the Wi-Fi name of the network and your password, and then you're also gonna need your Amazon account information. So that's gonna be your email address and your password. Uh, go get that information and let's get this thing set up. Hey everyone, it's Audrey with Simplifying Tech for Seniors.com. So this is one of the first videos in a series for the Amazon Echo Show, and this is at the very beginning. We're just gonna go over the basics of getting it set up, and then in future videos, we're gonna dive into your settings and everything that it can do for you. If you find that this video helps you in any way, why not share it, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button along with the bell button so you're notified every time that we put up one of these video tutorials. So let's jump in and get it all set up. So when you plug it in, it turns on automatically and the first thing you're gonna do is select your language. So mine is English. Ready for setup. Next, you're gonna connect to your Wi-Fi. So find your Wi-Fi name and tap on that. And now input your Wi-Fi password. A quick tip is if you wanna make sure that you type that incorrectly, you can tap on this show and it will show you your password. So you can just verify that all the letters, numbers, and characters are correct. We'll hide that back and tap on done. We'll leave everything as it is and tap on connect. Next, this is where you're going to put in your Amazon account that you want associated with this Echo Show and sign in. Tap on continue. Now it's just saying that Alexa is designed to protect your privacy, so tap on continue. And now it's confirming your time zone, which is, is, is correct for me, so I'm gonna tap on continue. So since my account is now attached to this Echo Show, all it did was just pull the address that I have on file. And if you don't have an address on file, you can skip this. However, you do want an address of some sort so that you can get local weather, traffic, and more. So we're just gonna tap on continue. And now it's just asking you, where are you gonna have this Echo Show in your home? And so for me, what I'm gonna do is um, put it in the kitchen. So we'll just choose kitchen. And then I can rename this. And so we're gonna rename this one so I know where it's at and I can communicate with it if I want to. So then I'm gonna tap on continue. This is where you get to choose the wallpaper uh, on your Echo. And so you can choose from Amazon Photos, Seasonal, Nature, Travel, Art, or Abstract Shapes. And of course, I love Seasonal, so we're just gonna tap on Seasonal and then continue. Okay, I will be honest with you, I am not very sure about sidewalk. Um, so until I know what I am enabling, um, I normally don't enable anything. So for this, I'm just gonna say disable until I can do a little bit more research and then bring you guys back a video that talks more in depth about it. So once again, it's saying, you know, you can help neighbors find pets and important items. I don't know what it does, so I'm just gonna disable it. Now, if you are using this device in a child's bedroom or uh, a child has access to it, I would definitely make it uh, child-friendly with Amazon Kids. Of course, my since this is going in the kitchen and if my grandkids were even to touch it or ask it to play something, I'm right there to be able to catch it, so I am just gonna say no. This is where you can choose to start a 30 day free trial of um, Amazon's Music Unlimited. After that, it's gonna be you know, $4.99 a month. Just so you know, you don't need Amazon Music to listen to music. Uh, there are different skills that you can uh, put on the Amazon, such as Pandora, and you can listen to music that way or even on YouTube. So I want you to know you don't have to get this, 
but it is great because it has unlimited music uh, with um, out ads and things like that. So uh, you can choose that. I'm going to say no thanks right now. And now this is where you can listen to audiobooks, podcasts, and more with Audible. I do have a subscription of this. I love listening to books and everything. Um, you could do a 30-day free trial here as well. Um, but right now, I'm just going to say no thanks. Yay, you are all set up and ready to go. So now since this is connected to my account, it knows what I've listened to. Um, and so, but just to show you real quick, in order to get to like your settings in your home, you would just simply swipe down. And this is all of the things that we're gonna be going over in the series, um, from smart home to your notifications, brightness, setting this up for you. And then you can also, swipe to the right and it has widgets so you can add your favorite Alexa features and access shortcuts and swipe down from the top of the screen and all of that so um, but this is where you can go to look at your widgets and um, recently played and rearrange them and everything so we'll be learning about that in this series as well all right, you should be good to go. You've got your Amazon Echo all set up and be on the lookout for the rest of this series in the Amazon Echo show and how you can use it to um, make your life a lot simpler and enjoyable. Until next video, y'all be blessed. Bye.